We are now back with our player of the game presented by Ebert Dental Group. Matt Jarrett led the team in scoring tonight. Awesome first half for you. Let's start there. Your start to the evening. Nothing was going well offensively for you guys. A lot of open looks. You weren't able to capitalize. Except for you, you really carried the scoring load. Did it feel like in your eyes, is that is that something that you had to do just given the shooting wells of the team? I mean, it wasn't something that I had to do. Um, you know, it was, you know, our team struggling to find a basket and we have five guys that can score the ball and you know it just got me open looks for because of the other guys and uh yeah i just took advantage of what the defense gave me and i got off to a quick start before last season you guys hadn't won a district since the 1960s you get back to the championship game at least an opportunity to defend your crown i imagine super satisfying for you and the entire senior class oh yeah it definitely is i mean we have seven seniors you know and saturday is gonna be a fun game you know colonel crawford's number one in the state we're you know somewhere number six i think whatever it is but you know it's gonna be a fun house it's gonna be exciting and uh you know we're gonna be ready and they're gonna be ready Felt like what decided tonight's game was that third quarter stretch right out of the gates. I think you guys went on like a 14, 15, nothing run. Describe that to me, and what did you feel like transpired there to help create some cushion? I mean, it was just it was just different guys scoring the ball. You know, Cam came out and had an and one, then a three. You know, Jude had a couple layups. Carson had an and one, and you know, just different guys were starting to you know get open looks and they were capitalizing on what they got. So, uh, I mean, it was a team effort there in the third quarter, and you know, started with stops. There's always conversation teams that are heading close to the tournament time undefeated about whether it's good or not to get a loss. You guys went ahead and took on a huge challenge, the number one team in Division Four, and they beat you on your home floor. What do you feel like you guys took away from that tasting defeat for the only time this season? That we still need to be better, you know. Uh, it was it would be nice to be undefeated, but, you know, we still we still have some improving to do. We took a lot from that game. You know, we had a lot of good, but we had a lot of bad, too. And so uh, we had a good week of practice. You know, we fixed some stuff, and... Uh, yeah, we just took advantage of uh, what Tevin Calvert did to us. Well, give me a quick preview. I know you guys know the Eagles. You played them last year during the regular season. A heck of a contest early on. What do they bring to the table, and what do you guys got to do to be able to get by the number one team? I mean, they bring, you know, obviously two really good players in Studer and Valentine. And, uh, you know, they're, and then their depth is really good, too. You know, they bring guys off the bench that can shoot it and drive the ball. They play good defense, you know, and then they're coached by a Sheldon. So they're always going to be there. So uh, it's going to be a really good game. We're excited, and I'm sure they're just as excited. So we'll see. All right. It was exciting to watch you play tonight. You're our OH Report MVP. You get a pin there. You can put awesome. that on your Letterman jacket, backpack, whatever you want to. Thank and then you. also, if you want to take this time looking at the camera, we got a big viewing audience going down on the Facebook. Who do you want to shout out tonight? Uh, I want to shout out my friends and family. Thank you for watching, uh, especially my Pat Ball. I know he watches every game on this thing. He loves it. So uh, I'm going to shout him out. And then, uh, yeah, just everybody that comes out, watches the game. Thank you guys for doing this. And uh, we'll see you on Saturday. Our pleasure. Matt Jarrett, MVP, presented by Ebert's Dental Group. Game high, 18 points tonight. Really carried the scoring load in the first half. Go celebrate with your teammates, man. Thank you. Thanks for the time. Yeah, thank you.